This marks 10 years of Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep services. We are honoring our babies over the last 10 years that we've served. More than 30,000 babies have been photographed around the world. We've had more than 8,000 photographers involved in our network from all over the world. We're just so appreciative of every photographer and every volunteer who has made Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep possible. And we're here to thank them and to honor our babies. You know, the photographers, I used to say, were the heart of this organization. And just recently, I really reconsidered that and thought, you know, it's the parents that are the heart of the organization, but it's these photographers that keep our hearts beating. That night I walked out of the hospital empty armed without my son and broken hearted. I still had hope of seeing my baby again and that hope came through the form of photography and knowing what that photographer sacrificed, my co-founder, to be there for us and to create those memories of us with our son. It was still a hope and that's the hope that kept my heart beating. Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep is a global organization and it's not about one person, it's not about one baby or one family or one photographer. It is about a community of parents that have unfortunately lost their precious babies and it's about coming together and helping them in this time of need. Oh my god, it's so amazing to see the growth, but you know, not, not just the growth, but the struggles that we've had along the way too and know that, you know, at one point in time we were in a sink or swim um, situation and we're swimming and we're still swimming and it's just a blessing to be able to help the families in the way that I have been helped. I'm sure we'll have tears, but I think the tears will be coming from a different place than heartache. I think the tears will be coming from a sense of pride, from a sense of honor, um, and just from a sense of community and just being all together for this one reason, to celebrate these tiny, tiny lives. It's also emotional and sad to think that people need our services, and even though it's difficult to offer what we do. We are providing healing to these families and we're providing memories and leaving a legacy of these babies that these families would otherwise not have. The strength, courage, and love that you show families during their time of need is truly admirable and it touches my heart. To the families here tonight, I thank you. I thank you for giving us the honor of photographing your baby of allowing us to be a part of your story, of letting us in and trusting us. It is something we hold very close in our hearts and with great respect. If there is a miracle to chase his story beyond his 54 minutes, it's that he has touched the lives of so many. During Chase's delivery, Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep was in constant contact with the nurses at the Vista Hospital, making sure that our wishes were followed, the photographer was lined up, and most importantly, truly caring how we were doing. It is the staff, photographers, volunteers, and donors with their compassion for families like mine that makes Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep such an extraordinary organization. Yeah, I've been in the photography business all my life, and, and this organization. I, I know each and every one of you in this room know how special this organization is. But in the world that I live in, in the, the mission of this group is um, nothing short of incredible, very, very unique. And it, it serves a purpose that, that most people don't understand until they're touched with it in one way or another. We would now like to have a moment of silence for these babies that have brought so much love to so many.